20. Oh, come on. Don't fall on me now. Stupid tripod. So I'm trying to be a little bit more professional. <laughs> Never seemed to work out though. <laughs> 22 and 21 hertz. This is 21 hertz. But I've done this before with 21 hertz and it shows interesting structures. The pictures on my profile, on my main opening page, are from from this hertz, from a double bubble, double bubble, where I put the bubble onto two speakers. Not on this setup, but the one that's down below it, much bigger speakers. But that one's just two speakers on top of each other, but they're really nice, waterproof, strong speakers. These are kind of smaller, weaker speakers, but still show cool stuff. You can see the cross pattern in the center there. You're always going to see that torus. It's just a matter of perspective of how it kind of changes around the bubble all the time because there's bunches of them. Um, and I'm only showing one little tiny point of view. Uh, and yes, I've tried putting lights all around these things. It, it just does not work like that. Uh, the more lights you use. I put these things inside of tubes that are like 12 or 14 inch tubes, uh, cardboard tubes, over the speaker with LEDs all throughout the whole entire tube. And it shows cool stuff, but it, it, it just doesn't work that way. The, the more lights, the less you actually will see. Which is kind of weird, because you would think more lights, more the more dimensional view you would see of the whole entire bubble. But the problem is, is what you're seeing is, is this one section here, but that same exact section is right next to it, right next to it, right next to it, all the way around and down there and up there. So it's kind of the same, same thing repeating itself. It might be kind of hard for you to understand and see it because you might be looking at this at the first time and all I, you have to understand how many different bubble videos I've done thousands of them literally and I know how to look at them now or read them so I can see a lot of more things going on maybe than most people or if someone's really into like drawing and stuff they'll probably see the same things but it's not showing everything so you can't see it so you almost have to know what it is to imagine the rest of it there because um, you're not going to be able to see it see how when I turn that one light on it adds to the bottom section down here And see the torus right there? It's a little tiny one. Now you see this one looks like you can't see it, but there's an X pattern here. It's going inwards and outwards, and the vortex is shooting up. The vortex is mostly four circles opposing each other as forceful things. It's always like the X pattern. See, there's the X pattern right there when I turn it. It's hard for you still to even see it. There's so much going on. On the single bubbles, just with one speaker, you can see it all the time. The multiple speakers, it's harder for you to see it because there's more of them. See them all back behind each other back there?
closer I get, it's not going to help either. Because then you're just kind of zooming into the lines. In order for you to see patterns, you got to back off. And the light's got to be backed off. Then you can kind of start seeing what's going on. But like I said, I've been doing this for a few years now, so I've learned to like look at these and understand kind of how they're, they work and how they do that. <laughs> oh, bubbles.